15th find the modulus of this expression over here this complex number okay if you are supposed to find the modulus we'll have to simplify first right right since the complex numbers are in addition and subtraction a lot of things are happening over here they're not they're not in multiplication and division had they been only in multiplication and division we could have applied properties of modulus but here we cannot apply properties of modulus directly what we'll have to do is we'll have to simplify first for finding the modulus let us take it as z equals 1 plus i over 1 minus i minus 1 minus i over 1 plus i simplifying this separately and this separately does not seem a good idea because on multiplying on taking the lcm you get conjugates getting multiplied together right had they not been conjugates we would have thought in another direction maybe but right now we can move directly by taking the lcm what do i have here is my 1 minus i times 1 plus i in the denominator this is the lcm and is it actually lcm no it is not actually lcm it is way of simplifying that is adding these fraction terms right okay and now what is lcm you may you may ask lcm is actually a multiple now when we talk about multiples multiples should be in terms of let us say natural number products right products with natural numbers but here we are simply multiplying these two together and in that case for simplifying what do we get over here in the numerator is 1 plus i whole square minus 1 minus i whole square right so we are adding these two fractions and this is how we do it okay next what do we get this 1 plus i square and this 1 minus i square is actually a square minus b square can you observe that yes so a square minus b square can be written as a plus b which is 1 plus i plus 1 minus i this is a plus b there's another bracket which is a minus b that is 1 plus i minus this minus 1 and minus of minus becomes plus i over here this is what i get right this is what i'll be getting what about the denominator this is a minus b a plus b which is a square minus b square this is what i'll get right what's the first term in the numerator can you observe that the i's get cancelled this becomes 2 what about this expression the one get cancelled and this becomes 2i okay what happens to the numerator sorry to the denominator in the denominator you have an i square which is equal to minus 1 1 minus minus 1 and product that will be equal to 1 plus 1 which is 2 okay and so this complex number is actually equal to 2i that complicated expression simplifies to this 2i and since z equals 2i implies modulus of z equals 2 and yes that is my answer for this question over here